The Department of National Defense and Philippine Army pushed through with the acquisition of new wheeled armored personnel carriers and light tank to improve the capability of the mechanized infantry division and armor division of the Philippine Army. The original plan was to acquire 114 new wheeled armored personnel carriers and an upgrade program for Cadillac Gage V-150 Commando and GKN Simba 4x4 wheeled armored vehicles, but later revised to acquire new armored vehicle and reduced to 28 units. The Philippine Army is planning to acquire 44 light tanks as part of its Horizon 2 priority projects under the revised AFP modernization program, but reduced to 30 different units. The winner for both acquisition project is Elbit Systems Land and C4I, of Israel. Max Defense Philippines publicly posted about the notice of award which they received a few months ago. Max Defense Philippines exclusively released information regarding both the light tank and wheeled armored personnel carriers and I quote, Elbit Systems was working with General Dynamics European Land Systems and Escalibur Army Czechoslovak Group to offer the Sabra light tank family using the ASCOD 2 tracked armored vehicle and the Pander 2, 8x8 wheeled armored vehicle or platforms. Also, Elbit Systems was working with Iveco Defense Vehicles for the Wheeled Armored Personnel Carriers Project, which offered to use the Guarani 6x6 Wheeled Armored Personnel Carriers, unquote. The light tank acquisition composed of 18 Sabra, as COD 2 track tanks and 10 Sabra, Pander 2, 8x8 wheeled tanks and equipped with Elba turret and 105mm gun, also included as one as COD 2 armored command vehicle and one as COD 2 armored recovery vehicle, also included as unspecified number of 105mm tank gun ammunitions, the project is part of Horizon 2 phase priority projects of revised AFP modernization program with contract price of 9,484,000,000 332,000 Philippine peso through government-to-government -government procurement with the Government of Israel. The Department of Budget and Management released the Special Allotment Release Order for Light Tank Acquisition worth 1,422,649,800 Philippine Peso or 15% initial payment is required, the Special Allotment Release Order dated October 15, 2020 but only released October 21, 2020. The project will be paid in multi-year obligatory allocations. Meanwhile, the Wheeled Armored Personnel Carrier Acquisition Project composed of 28 units of Iveco Guarani Wheeled 6x6 Armored Personnel Carriers, part of Horizon 2 priority projects of revised AFP modernization program through government-to-government -government procurement with Israeli Ministry of Defense. The Department of Budget and Management released Special Allotment Release Order the same day as the Light Tank Acquisition Project on Wednesday, October 21, 2020 with 15% initial payment worth 339,780,000 Philippine Peso, funded through General Appropriations Act starting fiscal year 2020, the contract price is worth 2,265,200,000 Philippine Peso. Both projects, the light tank and wheeled armored personnel carriers notice of award released and given to Elbit Systems Land and C4I sometime in third quarter of 2020 and the contract and notice to proceed is still pending.